Hi, I'm Chad with WC Branham Incorporated. In this video, we'll be discussing how to adjust the internal cushion screws on your pneumatic rodless cylinder. Most cylinders come standard with adjustable internal pneumatic cushions. Cushions can be found at either end of the cylinder and are provided to decelerate the loaded end of stroke and provide a dampening effect. Commonly on cylinders like our pneumatic cable cylinders here, the cushion screws can be found on each head with a hex head cap screw. On our MagTech magnetically coupled line of cylinders, the cushion screws can be located as the brass slotted screw on each head. On our Duratrack cylinders, the cushion screws are located inside the cover strip retainer block. Most cushion screws are simply adjustable with a standard slotted wrench. It's important when adjusting the cushion screws that the cylinder is attached to the load to represent the actual load and velocity that will be occurring to see if the cushioning effect is adequate. Once that's done and you can cycle your cylinder back and forth with the load attached, simply adjust your screws by first closing it completely, turning it clockwise until it stops, and I suggest you back it off a quarter turn as a starting point. From there, you can cycle it back and forth and see what the cushioning effect is, and only make minor adjustments by slightly turning clockwise or counterclockwise to increase or decrease the effect until you get them set to where you're satisfied. I recommend as a rule of thumb, observe it and even time it as necessary and see that your cushioning effect is approximately a 2,000 second count. Once you do that, your load will be able to safely decelerate at the end of stroke on each end. It's important to refer to the manufacturer's catalog information to see that your load versus velocity falls within their acceptable limits of their internal cushions. If not, external cushioning devices may be required. For more information and technical assistance, contact our sales group or visit our website at wcbranham.com.